Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Please subscribe and keep watching more details. PH spoilers. Anna blurts out Jason's FBI secret to a stunned Carly. General Hospital, PH spoilers, tease that the secret of Jason Morgan's, Steve Ferdin, disappearance hasn't yet become common knowledge. But it is only a matter of time before Carly Spencer, Laura Wright, and the rest of Port Charles find out exactly why Jason has been working as an FBI informant for over two years now. As viewers know, Jason was taken to Quantico where Agent John Cates, Adam Harrington, blackmailed him using Carly as leverage. General Hospital Spoilers Jason Morgan's cover has been blown. While Jason's cover within the Pikeman group is blown, Cates is still forcing Jason to with the FBI. During a particularly tense meeting between Jason, Cates and Anna Deven, Finola Hughes, Cates revealed that he had evidence of Carly's RICO violation when she was caught on a recording admitting that she was running the Corinthos organization at that time. Carly would spend at least 20 years in prison if Cates used the evidence he has against her. Carly still has no idea that Jason let the whole world believe he was dead for two years just to keep Carly out of prison. PH Spoilers Carly Spencer took matters into her own hands. Meanwhile, Carly believes she is helping Jason by investigating on her own the connection between Jack Brennan, Charles Mashore, and the Pikeman Group. Carly told Jack, who is an inmate at Pentonville, that the FBI was on to Pikeman. Giving Brennan such delicate information could put Anna, Jason, and Kate's investigation at risk. Anna confronted Carly, who seemed more determined than ever to help Jason. General Hospital Spoilers Anna Devon has had it with Carly Spencer. If Carly interferes again, Anna could easily lose her cool with the hotel owner. Perhaps it would even slip that Jason is working with FBI to save Carly from going to jail. That would change everything for Carly, who might even confess to the RICO violation in order to save Jason. It could also bring back romantic feelings between Jason and Carly, who have typically been better off being platonic with one another. One thing is for sure, Carly will never be the same once she realizes how far Jason was willing to go for her. PH Spoilers, what do you think? Will Carly back off Brennan? Will Anna reveal the truth to Carly? Where does Jason's big secret leave Jason and Carly once all is said and done? Anything can happen in Port Charles, so stay tuned to General Hospital airing weekdays on ABC. And don't forget to check back right here regularly for all your general hospital news, information, and spoilers. Gave spoilers, Wally Kurth talks about the one scene that had him choked up. General Hospital, GH spoilers, reveal there were some pretty emotional scenes during the Wednesday, May 15 show, as Brooklyn Porter Main, Amanda Sutton, and Harrison Chases, Josh Swickard. Wedding officially got underway. One in particular was a moment caught between the bride and her dad. As Ned Quartermain shared a sweet scene with BLQ, many fans could see the sincerity in his eyes as they got a little teary. Actor Wally Kurth recently revealed an interesting confession about the entire thing. General Hospital spoilers, fans took notice of Wally Kurth's phenomenal job. Each spoilers hint viewers got a little teary-eyed themselves watching Ned with his only daughter, moments away from walking her down that aisle to say her, I do's. A fan on the X social media platform recently posted a tweet, tagging Wally on a comment of how emotional Ned was during his scene with Brooklyn. Of course, Kurth replied with, when I first read that line at home, I choked up. Every time I read it, I choked up. At rehearsal, I choked up. I told Amanda Sutton before taping, I'm afraid when I do this, I'll be too self-aware. I tried to stay in the moment. It was beautiful dialogue. DH Spoilers, the scene between Ned and BLQ will be iconic 
What line got Wally all choked up? During the episode, while at the church's entrance area, Nit tells Brooklyn, I don't tell you enough how proud I am of you. Brooklyn, the woman that you've become, the story that you've already written for yourself. I can't wait to see how the rest of it unfolds. Bia Q notes that she can't wait either, and jokes, bet there will be some curve also. Ready to give me away. Ned replies by saying he will walk her down the aisle, so she can marry the man of her dreams. He does shake his head state, but I can't give you away. You'll always be my little girl. I'm not crying, you're crying. Maybe all Giecha fans shed a small emotional tear after that statement. Did you get a little teary-eyed during the Wednesday, May 15 show? Comment below. Catch your favorite soap on ABC each day and visit this site often for the best general hospital spoilers and news.